This is Mary Beth from WCI Consulting. Today I will be covering how to do the Fold and Unfold feature in Web Intelligence. The Fold and Unfold feature allows the user the ability to expand or hide sections of the report without having to drill down. You can create folds on sections or breaks. For this tutorial, I'm going to show the quantity sold by state and city. As you can see, I've already brought in state, city, and quantity sold objects from the eFashion universe and inserted them into a vertical table. First, we're going to create a break on state. To do this, select the state column. Under analysis, go to display and you'll see break. Select that and it will break apart each state and you'll see all the cities listed within each state. Then you're going to want to get the sum of quantity sold. So I'm going to remove the sum text. Now I'm going to do the same thing for city. In order to make the report look better, you're going to want to remove the repeating section headers. In order to do this, right click on a cell in the report, go to break, manage breaks, and uncheck the break header option. This will remove all of the break headers. And then in order to add back the table header, you will select the whole table, go to format table, and check the ta table headers box. I'm going to highlight the state total row. The last thing we need to do is to enable the option for the fold and unfold feature. In order to do this, go to analysis, interact, and then click on the outline button. As you will notice, once you click on the table, you will see that an outline appears on the left hand side. This gives the user the ability to fold or unfold the different levels. If we click on the two, then you will see that all of the cities will fold up leaving the city totals within each state. If you click on the one, you will notice that the city totals are folded up leaving you with only the state totals. And last, if you click on the T, then it will show you the total sum of quantities sold for all of the states. This concludes the folding and unfolding tutorial. Thanks for listening.